Malaria is a mosquito-borne infectious disease caused by Plasmodium. Every year, malaria affects more than 500 million people and kills more than 1 million people. In India, about 1.5 to 2 million cases of malaria reported each year. According to World Health Organization, 95% of Indian population resides in the malaria endemic areas. Plasmodium, an intracellular parasite, is the cause of malaria. This parasite has several species like Vivex, Falciparum, Ovale, and Malaria. Malaria is transmitted by a female Anopheles mosquito. A French army doctor, Laveran, first discovered the causative agent of malaria in 1880. And in 1898, Sir Ronald Ross proved that this parasite is transmitted by mosquito. Plasmodium completes its life cycle in two different hosts. Female Anopheles mosquito is the primary and human is the secondary host. The symptoms of malaria includes febrile paroxysm, which takes place at regular interval. The symptoms are chills, last for 15 minutes to 1 hour, high fever, approx 106 degree Fahrenheit, which lasts for 2 to 4 hours. The patient suffers from headache, vomiting, and diarrhea. Anemia is also occurs due to destruction of RBC by the parasites. Feelings of stomach pain, muscle pain are also associated with this disease. Malaria is mainly transmitted by a vector like Anopheles mosquito, but it may be transmitted by blood transfusion, contaminated feedings, and in some cases by the placenta. To control malaria, we should first control the vectors by destroying the breeding place of mosquito or by use of insecticides. By using mosquito net or mosquito repellent, malaria can be controlled. And the most important that the infected person should be treated by anti-malaria drugs. Plasmodium chose two hosts to complete its life cycle. The human cycle begins with the liberation of sporozoites in blood of human. This sporozoite come in liver cells and change its shape and becomes cryptozoites. This cryptozoites liberated by bursting the liver cells and attack human blood cells, especially red blood cells. Some cryptozoites, instead of attacking RBC, reach the fresh liver cells and give rise to metacryptozoites. The metacryptozoites attack RBC again and feed on the cytoplasm of RBC and transformed into the tropozoite stage. The mature tropozoite produce 12 to 24 merozoites. Some of the merozoites change to form microgametocyte or macrogametocyte. These two stages are non-infectious for the human. During blood meal, mosquito takes these two gametocytes in their gut, where fertilization occurs as a result, the eukinate stage of plasmodium develops. The eukinate further changes into oocyst stage. After 10 days of blood development, the oocyst mature and brush to liberate the sporozoites within the hemocyte of mosquito. Thus, sporozoites comes in the salivary gland of the mosquito, from where it is ready to transmit to the next human. And thus, the malarial parasite complete its life cycle into two different hosts.